Starting already. What the fuck? Wait. Oh, never mind. I'm just gonna talk about the reveal trailer real quick and then I have a lot of thoughts. First of all, I love how colorful the maps are. They don't look dull, like, at all. It's not boring. At least not as boring as it used to be. There's an assassination. That... Yeah. Also, it's like the weird little sniper thing. It's a sniper. I don't know why it says a sniper thing. You may remember that weird little, like, weapons leak at Destro that they're adding the MSR. I don't know how good the MSR is going to be, but so far in the beta, I've only seen two snipers or sniper, like, weapons be used. Sorry, not beta. Alpha. Uh, this gun, which I forgot what it's called. Just put it on screen. And the MK2 carbine, which is basically the quickscope weapon. It's less of a hit marker machine than any of the marksman rifles in Modern Warfare. At least so it's seen. I don't know. I haven't used them yet. I just watched professional snipers use them. The MK2 carbine is quick, though. Alright, that this is cool. Look at this. Whoop. Dolphin dives. I saw the, again, saw some footage. It's so much better than sliding now. It's kind of insane. Sliding is like completely useless now. If you slide, you're a nerd. Not even a nerd. You're just a moron. I don't know why you would do that to yourself. Alright, this is weird. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that was. But also, uh, the heartbeat sensors, they have batteries now. So now you can't just spam them non-stop. Thank you, Infinity Ward. You're gonna be okay. Yeah, this is the hostage rescue mode. Everyone said Rainbow Six. Oh my god, I've never played Rainbow Six. So I don't know how similar that is, but I do know there's a Counter-Strike hostage mode. That's what this reminded me of, personally. There's the camera from Black Ops. I don't think anyone's gonna use that, I'm gonna be honest with you. Gotcha. And this is the weird little, like, lean, not leaning, it's not leaning, ledge hanging, that's what it's called, yeah. I'm fucking stupid for saying this, but, like, the only comparison I have to this feature is, like, what they have in Titanfall, where, like, when you're wall running, you can just, like, stop in midair, and it, like, fucks up your accuracy, at least in the first game it does, and then you just, but you get to, like, I don't fucking know. Get ready, team. We have never seen a war zone like this. <gasps> he said the thing, he said war zone! <laughs> <laughs> now the Warzone map looks cool, but the general consensus of Warzone 2 uh, Now I I'm not a Warzone guy, so I can't give a take on it But like it, it definitely looked a little unfinished, but then again, that's because it is unfinished The main multiplayer is also unfinished I wouldn't be surprised if the COD next build is like earlier than like the, like the open beta build coming out tomorrow Either way, there's like a whole other month for Warzone compared to multiplayer Oh yeah, that's a shock charge. Gunsmith, I've already seen this Third per- oh, this is nuts, by the way. A lot of people complaining, like, oh, why is it switch from third person to first person? But honestly, watching Zuma stream, it looks kind of cooler, I will admit. I might be weird for that, but I like how this looks. We'll see how it ends up in the end, but, like, I, I kind of like it. You are now and get free- now and get Early access. Early access. Oh my god. Now, obviously, here's what everyone's thinking. But let me just get in the game real quick. I need to talk about it, all of this. Play the beta, if only. I don't know why I'm on here. I'm trash at this. Oh, this guy's gonna get his shit rocked. I'm calling it. Or not, I guess these guys are ass. What am I watching? Is this the guy Infinity War is trying to cater to? Whenever they add anything to that game, this is just the guy they have in mind. Dude, Infinity War is like the funniest developer. Like, there's all, all these people in the community just like happily offering like great feedback, you know. Like, there's all these people like just happily ready to just like give their own opinions and like help out with like the development of the game and then Infinity War just decides to listen to nobody. Ruin the mini map by bringing back whatever the hell Modern Warfare had at launch. Making Dead Silence a field upgrade again and then adding back last day. I don't know who the hell is behind these decisions. I am gonna lose it. It's so weird. Now there's good things in Mono Warfare. For example, slide canceling, it's gone, no more. I think bee hopping is still a thing, but like bee hopping in Mono Warfare was always kind of weird. What the fuck? Yeah, slide canceling is gone because sliding is just completely useless now. It's like ghost sliding. Like it was already pretty useless in that game, but now dolphin diving was added back and it's way faster. It does, I don't know if it does the same thing. I might be stupid. But it's clearly better than sliding right now, and I feel like it's probably more fun as well. Also, they were like hinting toward like a strafing ability. What the hell happened to that? Is that just not happening now? I guess that was a lie, because not not only that, but like strafing is also just kind of slow in this game. In fact, everything looks kind of slow. I don't know if it's just because I was watching a main AR. It just felt like Modern Warfare 2019, but like everything weighed 10,000 kilograms. I mean, shit, I gotta play it for myself, right? But like, also, I'm just gonna... Dude, I'm gonna feel so left out. There's like a whole four days where everyone's gonna play except me. But hey, at least Guilty Gear is coming to Xbox next year. 
fuck. So they did do some good things. Got rid of slide canceling. Fuck that. Yeah, the maps are more colorful and they look nicer. Another thing, I haven't seen any doors. I've seen a couple doors. Like mainly in Warzone, I see doors. But there's way less doors now than there used to be. It feels like they finally found the optimal door map. I mean, the optimal door map is zero, but like they've gone closer. All right. They're getting there. They're just giving us hints, you know. They're like, it's like, <laughs> you'll happen eventually, you know. That's why they're the funniest developer. They're hilarious. These two graphics look nice and I like the UI. They're also adding some like in game chat shit not even like in-game chat but like just like a straight up full messaging like built into modern warfare 2 like the social features are crazy oh my god you cannot be serious oh yeah proximity chat dude it almost makes up for non disbanding lobbies almost just almost like a little now the main criticism of warzone 2 at least from what i've seen i don't fucking know i know i know nothing about warzone it's that the the gulag is weird and to be fair it kind of is it's a 2v2 gulag now you get teamed up with a random guy like who is not on your like regular squad it's already weird in itself but like there's usually no communication like i think they i think they thought there was going to be communication but there ends up being nothing and then you have to like, get like a key or something i don't get it i'm not sure What the fuck? Am I stunned? It? I'm dead. It's over. There's AI in Warzone 2, like just around the map. Ground War seems good, at least. I don't really like Ground War in Modern Warfare, but that's mostly just because like filled with like camping snipers. It's like annoying to play against. I barely played any of it though. I definitely feel like the fact that they got rid of classic mini map again th deserves more of a mention. It's just mega fucked up. I don't understand why they would do that. They. Do they not remember when everyone said, hey, don't do this, please just bring back the classic one. They're like, fine, we'll do it. We'll promise never to make that mistake again. They made the mistake again. This is why they're hilarious, by the way. Absolutely hysterical. I paid $100. Okay, well, they're adding it back as a perk, but even then, people are saying it's not like fully back. Like with the perks, I don't know what the hell is going on. Basically, the same with the old minimap in case you're like clueless. Uh, when pe someone fired an unsilenced weapon, then you saw them on the minimap, whether you had UAV on or not. Like a little red dot would appear, and then you get like a slight idea of like where they are. That's not in the game anymore. And also, squad spawns are probably back. I there's no definitive proof yet. Nobody really talked about it, but I'm gonna have to assume they are. The Warzone 2 map is fucking crazy though. They've got dome terminal. What's it called? showdown or some bullshit it's like like that one like that one stadium map in call of duty 4 the one where you like get shot in the campaign i forgot what it's called i'll just just put it on screen i am at a loss they've got high rise i think bro there is too much i wouldn't be surprised if i'm gonna like end this video and then i'm just gonna like be like oh i forgot about this and that and this they showed so much it's crazy they went super in depth i'm just happy we're getting closer to launch all right well i don't want to record anymore modern warfare 2 it's looking yeah it's looking that's it